Hello, Gene OK Boomer here. Welcome to today's vlog. Today's vlog is going to be a short one and it's going to be an unusual, unique one because I'm going to do something I've never done before. I think I better give you my disclaimer that I often give in my vlogs, which is that I'm a conservative. Always keep that in mind when you evaluate whatever I say. And it's especially appropriate today because because I'm a conservative, it's going to surprise everybody, but I'm going to compliment President Biden. He's been getting a lot of criticism for his handling of the uh, economy. Uh, maybe you've noticed some inflation, a little bit of inflation when you go to the uh, supermarket or to fill up your, your tank in your car. But he's actually done one thing very good for the economy, and that's the number of anti-Biden uh, merchandise that he has inspired. Uh, either F Joe Biden, F uh, rhymes with truck, or the ever popular uh, Let's Go Brandon. There have been t-shirts, bumper stickers, uh, a little sticker, one of my favorites, it's just a little sticker of Joe Biden pointing and saying, I did that. And people have been putting it on gas pumps, pointing at the, the price of gas and saying, well, I did that. But this is a, a new twist I never thought of uh, myself. Uh, congratulations to the person who's doing it. But let's go right to the headline. Award-winning restaurant sells new hit, quote, F Joe Biden, unquote, and quote, LGB, unquote, that would be Let's Go Brandon. And I think you can guess what the other one means. Pizzas, and they are selling fast. The award-winning Solarzano's, I hope, I hope I got that right. The award-winning Solarzano's Pizza and Italian Eatery in Sarasota, Florida, has a new bestseller from their new menu item, a pizza with, quote, FJB, unquote, uh, you know, F rhymes, rhymes with truck, uh, Joe Biden, written in pepperoni toppings. And the latest edition is, quote, LGB, unquote, for Let's Go Brandon. And you can see, here's the photo. Uh, according to the owner, this is due to his frustration with the Biden administration in terms of supply chain issues, resulting in high prices of certain items and fewer stocked items. The restaurant has had some positive feedback on their pizza lineup, except for some hateful comments from the intolerant left. Kenny Palin, who runs that particular location, it's a chain, it's a franchise, I understand. And um, Kenny Palin, so Solorzano, he's the, the head guy. And then this is a, a local owner. Anyways, Kenny Palin uh, and Solorzano are admittedly not fans of Biden, and he has received multiple negative reviews after he created the FJB menu item. His fans, he writes, are fighting back in the comments. However, if someone walks in and orders a quote FDT unquote pizza, which would be F Donald Trump, Palin says he would make it. Quote, we would absolutely make a pizza with that. If you come in with $19 for a pepperoni pizza, we'll write whatever you want, unquote, Palin said. But I guess the question for me is, so if you want a pizza for a gay wedding, will, will you do it? I guess the, the, this guy would. That's it for today. Thanks, as always, for stopping by. I appreciate the time you spend with me. If you have any questions, suggestions for future topics, uh, you can put them in the comment section below the video. You could subscribe. I love getting new subscribers. You could share this video with anybody you think would enjoy it as well. But most of all, come back and see me again. I would love to see all of you again. I look forward to seeing all of you again. And until I do see all of you again, bye.